And we've been tracking some scattered showers throughout the morning, heading into the afternoon. We'll see some of those showers break up, but windward and Malco showers still a good possibility as we have those trade winds flowing around. Here's a look at some of the uh, showers we saw earlier. We had some heavy rainfall into parts of Maui and also over to the Big Island. Had some heavy showers uh, near Kailua, Kona. So as we head through the rest of the day, hit and miss showers mainly in windward and Malco sections. And yes, those trade winds are back. We are monitoring a disturbance uh, southeast of the Big Island. This could be our next. Tropical depression or tropical storm. It's called Invest 96C, and that invest just means we're investigating. Winds at 30 miles per hour. The northwest motion is at five. Computer models kind of all over the place with this invest, this disturbance we have to our south and east. And the reason for that, it really just hasn't developed yet. And, and when those systems are weak, when they're uh, weak, low pressures, we don't have a whole lot of information to feed into the computers. That's why the Computer models can be kind of all over the place. Some of the models want to push it to the north and east of the Big Island, other models to our south. Bottom line is we'll keep a very close eye on it. If we did see any effects, that would be as early as Sunday, but mainly I think rain's probably the biggest threat right now. The wind impacts seem to be low, but again, a lot is up in the air. Well, I'll just have to see if this does develop. Central Pacific Hurricane Center giving a 70% chance for formation. Passing trade showers for today is the main story. Trade winds are back. 15, 20 miles per hour. Those trade showers affecting windward and Malka sections. But we have enough and a strong enough wind flow, especially as you head up in the atmosphere, that we could see a few of these showers make it to leeward sections as well by the afternoon. So just a heads up, leeward spots could see a sprinkle or two. Mainly though, windward and Malka, 87 in Hilo. Surf forecast uh, trade wind flow, creating a trade surf uh, on the east. Uh, east shores, three to six there, and we do have a small craft advisory in effect for the waters off of Maui and the Big Island. Here's the extended forecast. Today, the first full day of fall. Fall started last night at 10:21, but today we will have our first full day of fall. Not going to feel very fall like. 90 degrees is the high. We'll call for breezy conditions through the week, and again, as we head towards Sunday, that's when we'll be watching for the potential for that disturbance to our south and east to get closer to the islands. We'll keep you up to date.